Okay, so hello, I am Marcus, and welcome to this special webinar about how to make your visitors convert uh, with a new project I'm working on called the Landing Page Dude. And what I want to do is I want to go over all the ways that people build landing pages and how to make them work for you, right? How do you take a landing page and actually put it up there on pay-per-click and uh, make it convert, right? What is it that we need to do to make these things convert? And that's what we're going to be going over today. Uh, for those that are new to me, um, my name is Marcus, and I've been doing internet marketing for about 15 years. The information that you are going to learn are the little things that you need to know to make this stuff work. Okay, and a lot of this stuff you probably don't even know that you need to know it until now. And these are the little nuances that make a difference between a site floundering and making nothing to a site that's making millions of dollars or thousands of dollars or whatever it is you're trying to accomplish, right? And this is something that I have tested with over $1.5 million of my personal money that I've gone out there and bought uh, traffic for and actually tested this out. Now, the good news is um, on that $1.5 million, I've made a heck of a lot of money, okay? So really good stuff. So when I talk about pay-per-click, you don't have to have $1.5 million to invest. You don't have to have 1000 to invest. You don't even need to have a dollar to invest. You could get by on the free coupons that I'm going to show you how to use. The fact of the matter is, is that this stuff works no matter how slow or how low your budget is or how fast and how aggressive you want to be. Right, because what we're seeing is results at the speed of thought. I remember years ago when I first started internet marketing, uh, there was a book out by Bill Gates, and he sees things that not a lot of people see, which makes him make a lot of money that other people don't have. And one of the things that he saw was business at the speed of thought. This was 15 years ago, I believe, when he wrote this book, maybe a little bit after that, where he was talking about the idea of the internet and people being able to make money instantly, being able to conduct business instantly, being able to get files instantly, being able to order things without actually tangibly receiving them. I mean, I want you to think about this for a minute. Uh, 30 years ago, if you were to buy something um, that you would not actually get, something in the way of knowledge or um, critiquing or uh, help or coaching, right? You would actually have to pick up the phone, call someone, run your credit card number, and you know that person would either have to schedule an appointment with you or coach you or uh, have you come down to the office. And what Bill Gates was trying to say in that book years ago is that things are changing. Right, things are changing. Now people buy things without even seeing them. Right, we just had a huge, huge payday, one of the biggest in history with um, the singles day on Alibaba site. I think it was like $6 billion in a day, which is absolutely absurd. Okay, so now what we want to do is we want to talk to you about how do we get that for us? How do we get a portion of that by taking a person from what they're searching for and getting them to interact on our site? So, what I'd like everyone to do is relax and give me the next 90 minutes of your undivided attention. And I guarantee in exchange for your free payment of 90 minutes, right? That's what you're doing. You're saying, Marcus, I'm going to give you 90 minutes and you are going to show me a skill. At the end of the 90 minutes, you will be able to map out a landing page that will actually convert your visitors into money. Now, I know a lot of people say, Marcus, you know, it's hard to get traffic, right? How many of you guys feel like it's hard to get traffic? Type traffic in the box, All right? If you feel like it's hard to get traffic, then that means that your squeeze page isn't converting well enough. Because if you follow the line of thinking of a high converting squeeze page or a high converting landing page, and you utilize that in your market, then traffic is totally easy to get, right? You look at these people who spend $100 per click on traffic. The only reason they're able to do that is because their landing page converts. So what we're going to do over the next 90 minutes is we're going to show you how to create a landing page that converts, which means at the end of 90 minutes, you're going to have a skill or knowledge about a skill that is going to be valuable in the marketplace. How many of you guys would like to see your value in the marketplace go up in the next 90 minutes, right? What I'm doing is I'm going to impart something of value to you that you can sell, you can utilize on your own, you can um, broker out to other people, you can test all kinds of things because this is what works. Now, 
First of all, what I'd like to do is I'd like to backtrack a little bit and go over how this all works, right? Everyone knows landing pages are good, but not a lot of people know how to make them and not a lot of people know what the heck to do with them. So number one, first and foremost, the first thing you wanna do is realize that it's all about finding your niche, right? Your target is to find out where people are and what they want, AKA it's all about search intent or the intent of your visitor. Okay, it's all about the intent of the visitor. Now the search intent means why did they come to your site in the first place, right? Why are they here? If I was to ask you on a scale of one to 10, how confident you are that you know why your visitors are on your site, what would you say? 10 being, I know exactly why they're on my site. One being, wow, I need to know. Okay, and type that in the box. Let me know what you're thinking. We got a 10, we got a one, a lot of ones here. Okay, and we want to take a look at this and say, well, what's the deal? Now, let me precursor that. A lot of people say, well, Marcus, I know why people are on my site and I know what they want, but you're not making money. Okay, so if you have not been able to make money with a landing page, I'm sorry, you're at a one, right? Because you don't know. So what we want to do is we want to look into this idea of search intent. And what I did is I put up a screenshot here of the top keywords related to the internet marketing term in uh, dating. Okay, so we want to look at the term dating. I want you to ask yourself and I want you to be interactive, right? Make, it a, make a commitment to yourself that you're going to start being interactive in these webinars. You're going to start participating because what you want to extract from this is going to come out of what you're going to put into this. Okay, if you passively sit on all my webinars and say, yeah, great, that sounds like a wonderful idea. Maybe someday I'll try that. Perhaps one day I'll make a landing page. Perhaps one day I'll actually decide on a niche and try it out without the fear of failure, right? Until you decide that you are going to be active and proactive in your marketing, you are not going to get results. So we have these words here, dating, free dating sites, Christian dating, dating sites, dating advice. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to think in your mind what someone would want if they're looking up free dating sites. Okay, they're looking up the term free dating sites. What do you think they want in one sentence? Type that sentence in the box and we're going to see if anyone can get this, get this nail on the head here. Okay, Rob says a relationship, uh, hookups, Victor says, what else? Uh, chicks, okay, advice, uh, what to find a date for the night, find someone to have a relationship with, okay, keep them coming, these are, these are good so far, they want to find a date without having to pay, they want friends, uh, somewhere to meet and date people free, they want marriage, not to be lonely, okay, all of these are correct answers, but are they answers that would drive your landing page, right, are they answers that would drive your landing page. So we have one that says holidays together. Okay, that wouldn't drive our landing page, right? I mean, it's like, okay, you want a free dating site. Hello, welcome to my site. I'm gonna show you have, how to have holidays together with a significant other using these free dating sites, right? That's not exactly what they want. Or how not to be lonely. Stop being lonely by checking out these free dating. No, see what's happening is we are, one, putting the cart before the horse and two, putting the cart in front of us so that we can't, we can't even go anywhere. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to break this down and say free dating sites. Okay, uh, Kathy says how to set up free dating sites. Not necessarily. So when we take a look at this word free dating sites. Okay, these people want dating sites that are free. Okay, um, does everyone get that? Okay, that when I say you guys are overcomplicating this stuff, I really, really mean it because what they want is dating sites that are free. Okay, so I want you to think of the magic landing page that would work in this market. Okay, you got 450,000 people a month searching for this and they want some info. Okay, Darren says no dating sites are true. That's not, that's not absolutely true, right? What that means is you're making a generalization about the dating sites you've seen. Okay, there are free ones out there and your job is to find them and help these people with them. Or what you can do is also use free trials. Okay, so what this would look like to me would be like a review type site, right? Hello, welcome to my site. Here's the free dating sites. 
if you're in your 50s, you might want to check out, you know, Baby Boomers, uh, you know, meetup.com or whatever. Or, um, you know, if they're 70, it could be Dating for Seniors or something like that. And you would list all those ones, right? So what we want to do is we want to go and backtrack to the idea of free dating sites. Notice that they, they believe there's free dating sites out there. That's first and foremost. And two, they kind of want like a list of these free dating sites. Okay, now when we look at the word Christian dating, it's a little bit different. Okay, they could want information on Christian dating or they could want Christian dating sites. Okay, does everyone see how there's a split there? There could be one of two things. If you see that, type a two in the box. Okay, it could be people wanting to know about, you know, is Christian dating uh, good for religious people? Or they could be looking for, hey, where's the Christian dating sites? I want to find someone uh, to date that's a Christian. Okay, very important. Uh, dating sites, very similar to uh, free dating sites. Dating advice, all right, this is a little bit different. Okay, they want advice on how to date. Dating service, they want a service about how to date. Like they want someone to go find someone for them. Is this all making sense on a scale of 1 to 10? 1 being I'm lost, 10 being I get it, where are you? Okay, I don't want you to answer that. Okay, looks like everyone's between a 6 and a 10, which is good. Okay, I want this to sink in. I want you guys to understand how this works because this is where we want to go. Now, I want you to, to look at this, and I want you to look at some of the intentions that you found. One was don't be lonely. Another was find someone. And I want you to think about a word like chat, right? What, what kind of chatting do people want to do? They want to chat online. Okay, so the question is, is who do they want to chat to? Um, what kind of sites can we get them in? Uh, how do we get them started, et cetera, et cetera. And the word lonely, obviously, would be different from free dating sites because these people are just lonely and they might want friends, they might want significant others, et cetera. So what we want to look at is our trigger words plus these non-competitive niches. Because if you could crack the code to a word like chat that's eight cents a click, believe me, you're going to make a fortune. Type fortune if you believe that. Right, you look at it, you got 4 million searches a month for the word lonely, and it's 18 cents. You got seven, uh, or I'm sorry, 68 million searches a month for the word chat. So if I could show you how to make 16 cents a click on the word chat, how many of you guys think you'd be making a pretty darn good income? Right, of course you would. So the name of the game is how do you do that? Right, and what we're going to show you today is exactly how to do that. Now I realize there's lots of soap operas, there's lots of other things fighting for your attention right now, but if you want to have the right to complain about internet marketing, you need to listen because what I'm going to do is show you something absolutely cut and dry, ready to go, ready to work, and if it makes sense and the numbers make sense, you can go out and test it in as little as a few hours. Okay, how many of you guys think that that would be valuable? You say, Marcus, okay, if I could learn how to build something and test it within a few hours and potentially make, you know, even 10 cents a click off all these people, then I would be making a fortune. So we start with our trigger words and non-competitive niches. Next, what we want to do is we want to take a look at our landing pages. Now, by show of hands, which of these landing pages, just by the looks alone, do you think would convert better? Right, with this one's got a lot of explanation, it's got a lot of links, it's got these, which are actually movable graphics, and this one just has a list of like 16 different players or something like that. Okay, which one do you think would actually convert better? Because once you get the answer to this, you're going to learn the difference between making nothing and making a lot. Now, a lot of people are very split, okay, I'm getting answers that say, uh, the one on the left and the one on the right. So it's right down the middle split. Okay, and a lot of you guys might be thinking, uh-oh, is this a trick question? What's going on? Now, here's the deal. One of these pages made me as much as $5,000 a day, and one of them didn't make anything. It didn't break even, right? I actually lost money on it. Okay, so now, wouldn't you like to know which of the two it is and why? How many of you guys would like to know which of the two and why? Okay, we're going to get to the why in a little bit, but those of you who chose this page here on the right are, in fact, the correct answering people, right? On the right is the one that worked. Why did it work? We're going to talk about it in a little bit, but it's simplified.
Okay, a lot of people are going to overcomplicate this. Number one, we want to look at these things, okay? Number one, focus on the user. Okay, what is the user? Why are they there? Where did they come from? What do they want to do? These are the types of questions that we need to ask before we even buy a domain name, before we even buy a site, before we even install WordPress, before we even build a landing page, before we do anything, you need to answer these questions. Okay, because once you answer these questions, getting traffic is easy, right? I want everyone to write down on their paper, getting traffic is easy. Okay, everyone can get traffic. You could go in the most competitive niche and pay 500 bucks a click and you can get traffic. That's not the problem. The problem is, is how do I make $501 off that click or more? Very, very important question to ask yourself. Number three, who has your ideal traffic? Where are these people, right? And then number four, we wanna think outside the box because when we look at a lot of these keywords, right? If we were to look at a lot of these keywords like the word lonely, and we typed it in our Google AdWords keyword tool like this, okay? We can get an updated result of what this, what this word's about, how many searches and everything like that. All right, so we have this word here, which is lonely, and we could see that this word lonely gets about a quarter of a million direct searches per month. Pretty good, right? We could see it's low competition and it's $1.36 per click. Now, if you have $1.36 for every click, you could buy traffic right now within five minutes. Okay, does everyone understand that? Type five minutes. You can go to Google AdWords, you can have an account. You will actually show up on Google within five minutes. Same thing with MSN, right? Same thing with banner ads. Same thing with solo ads. If you buy email ads, you can get this stuff out in minutes. Okay, so traffic's not the issue, right? Traffic is not your problem. Your problem is, how do I get this ranked? And let's see what it looks like on Google. So we're going to go to Google here. And we're going to type in lonely and see what comes up. Now, for the word lonely, we have zero, zero people uh, advertising. We got some YouTubes. Okay, very, very little competition. Okay, there's no one bidding on it, which means there's a lot of traffic, little competition. So... Very easy. If you had a way to make money, you could get the traffic right now. Traffic is not my problem. Say that. Traffic is not my problem. Traffic has never been your problem, right? You just made it a problem because the human brain likes to overcomplicate things. You want a million visitors tomorrow? Great. Save up enough money to put an ad on Huffington Post, um, you have Facebook on their main page, right? Whatever, whatever it is, traffic is not your problem. I want you to say it over and over again until it gets in your brain. I want you to write it over and over again. And next time you say, well, Marcus, you know, I'm not getting any website traffic, therefore I'm not making money, then what's happening is you're not really getting it because traffic has never been your problem. Conversion is your problem, okay? Conversion is your problem. And the number one way to combat conversion is to think outside the box and ask, where is my ideal person? Where is my ideal person? Now, once you do that, you get into the whole idea of CPA marketing. Okay, CPA marketing is cost per action marketing. And you'll notice if we go there and we say, well, this, look, this lonely word looks good. If we go to OfferVault, and I use OfferVault because they are a a list of the top CPA offers. Okay, OfferVault is not a CPA network. A lot of people ask me, how do I apply to OfferVault? Very simple, you don't. You do not apply to OfferVault, right? You find the keyword or the uh, offer that you want, and then you apply at the network that has it. Okay, so if I wanted to run this whole home solar rebates offer, okay, first page submit. What it's saying is I get paid when people put their info here about a solar rebate. So I get $17.50 when they put first name, last name, address, zip, email, phone, how much their electric bill is, and um, is your home shaded. Okay, pretty cool, right? So I get $17 for that. Now, what this is saying is that I actually, if I uh, go to Aragon Advertising, I can run this ad. Aragon's going to give me a check for $17.00. And 50 cents every time I get someone to fill out that form. Okay, everyone with me? 
right? Offer Vault just shows me what the offers are. I have to go to the network to actually get it. Okay, pretty cool. We're going to show you how it all works as well. Now, when we go to Offer Vault, we want to type in a word that is related to our niche. So if I was to type in something like lonely, I'm probably going to get a bunch of dirty type offers we could run or nothing. Okay, that shows where my mind is, right? Um, now, for the word lonely, we could see that very, very little amount of people actually uh, have offers for this. Actually, none. Up, oh, let's see. Lonely. There we go. All right, let's try it again. We should have a few. Maybe my mind wasn't that bad. Okay, yeah, it is. Okay, this is what I was thinking. Married but lonely, lonely cheating wives, different things like this. Okay, now we don't necessarily want to use this stuff. Okay, that's probably not what they're looking for. I doubt someone looking up lonely is looking to cheat on their spouse. I just, that's just me, right? They could be. I doubt it, though. What I think the people lonely are is people who are sitting on their computer, who sit on their computer a little too much and haven't learned this thing called actually going outside to meet people. And they're lonely and they want to meet people, right? So we look at this and we say, well, the word chat and the word lonely kind of fit with this. Then what we want to do is find out if an offer is going to work. Okay, we could do something like a dating site, right, like this. Okay, we could see what kind of dating sites they have and things like that. So we have uh, all these guys. Let's get past the sponsored ones. And we have offers like uh, buddies, uh, flirt.com, um, you know, very, very uh, basic stuff, some weird stuff, and uh, dating and things like that. So what we're looking at is the fact that there's lots of offers. Now, we want to start to think outside the box, right? We want to think outside the box, and that's exactly what we did with the MySpace site. We thought outside the box and said, well, you know, these people looking up layouts and, and music players for their site, you know, maybe they'll want these cursors or maybe they'll want this little download or whatever it is. Okay, so we want to think outside the box and say, where is my ideal person? Very, very crucial to your marketing, right? We want to look at that and say, where are they? Next, what we want to do is look at the keywords, look at the value, okay? If we have something for like, tips for memory improvement and we get it five cents a click, we could think outside the box, go to Neverblue and run MindDabble. Okay, very easy. Now, I want you to realize that value is the future of CPA marketing. If you want to make money as a CPA marketer, you need to provide value that the vendor is not providing. Okay, you could do this in the form of a PDF, an MP3, a review, a report, infographic, video files, articles, spreadsheets, cool quotes, interviews, etc. But you need to answer the most important question, and that is, why should I look at your offer? Why should I look at your website? Why should I put my name and email in the box? Why should I read your email? Why, why, why? If you do not ask that question, you are not going to get results. So many people just put up a site hoping traffic's going to come and they put some banners on there hoping people click. We are not in the business of hope marketing, okay? We don't hope things work. We make things work. Write that down. I don't hope my traffic converts. I make my traffic convert. And if it's not converting enough to justify the amount of time or money that my site needs to get traffic, then I am not going to be able to make this work and I need to make it work exercise time. I want you to take a look at this Ancestry toolbar. Okay, the Ancestry toolbar gives the visitor a download that puts a toolbar on their computer and lets them find out information about their ancestors, um, get, you know, genealogy stuff, all that stuff that people are into. Okay, what we want to do is we want to take a look at this and say, I can go to Neverblue or wherever. I can run this offer. And when someone downloads the free toolbar, okay, it doesn't cost me anything, I get $4.12. Okay, I'll show you this in Offer Vault. Should still be there. There we go. Discover Ancestry, $4.12 per download. Very cool. All we have to do is get these people to download this. Here's what the landing page looks like. Very important that you look at your landing page. Okay, looks like I already have this for Windows 10 or something. There we go. 
let me see if I can get a screenshot. There we go. Okay, so um, what we have here is family history name, please install, and this is going to give you the stuff. So this is our toolbar here, right? This is our toolbar here that they get for free. Now, our job is to take people that are looking up these words, like find ancestors, which is high competition, find your ancestors, high competition, right? And we want to go off the beaten path and use words like U.S. Census, right? Why do we use this word? Because this is the type of thing that people look up when they're doing ancestor stuff. If we can find a way to crack the code to this low competition word, we'll be able to make money. But the name of the game is... We have to get enough people to download this that come to our site as possible for this to work. Okay? So, traffic is easy. We know that. The offers are there and they pay. We know that. So, the last piece of the puzzle is your job. Right? Write this down on your paper. Say, my job is to create highly effective landing pages that get people to the things that pay me money. Okay, my job is to create highly effective landing pages that get people to go to the things that make me money. All right, if your landing page isn't working, then your traffic's not going to the offer. All right, if the offer doesn't make money, you don't have a whole lot of control over that. All right, if I send a thousand people to this offer and no one downloads, there's three variables. One, does my traffic suck? Two, does my landing page suck? Three, does the Discover Ancestry toolbar actually convert? Okay, now, does my traffic suck? We can change that. We can get good traffic. Okay, we could change that. Is my landing page good? Mm-hmm, okay, we could change that. If it's not getting the conversions, we can change that. Does the Ancestry page convert? We can't change that. That variable is out of our hands. That's up to the guy who owns discoverancestry.com. Now, we can go a step further and say, well, can we precondition them to download, right? A lot of times we could put a little click to install button on our page. It'll increase the amount of people because they're anticipating what's on the next page, right? If I just say, hey, click here, ancestor stuff, they're not going to download it. If I say click here to download this, they're going to download more. Does that make sense to everyone? Okay, the changing of that phrase is the difference between success and failure online. Right? The changing of the phrase is the difference between success and failure online. So when I go to words like U.S. Census, I need to somehow in my mind say, how do I pair U.S. Census with the Ancestry toolbar? How do I get these people to think, wow, I need that toolbar. I want that toolbar. Holy crap, it's free. I better download it. Because until they download it, I don't get my $4.12. Very, very important, right? I don't get that money unless I get them to convert. So we want to take a look at this, right? Lots of low competition keywords here. Now, check out the no competition. You can easily find 30 bucks a day or more in these markets, right? That's only, what, eight downloads, okay? If you wanted $400 a day in revenue, $400. $12 a day to be exact. All you got to do is get 100 people a day to download the toolbar. Not that hard to do. But the question is, how do we do that? Now, what we want to do is we want to look at this and realize it works with SEO, pay-per-click, video marketing, blogs, list building, banner ads, article marketing, CPA offers, ClickBank, affiliate programs, and more. It works with everything. Okay, why does it work with everything? Because everything is traffic, right? Everything is traffic. All those things I just mentioned, you say, Marcus, you know, all that stuff seems so complicated. A lot of it has to do with traffic. What I want you to do first and foremost is think about how people search, how they react, what they do, what do they click, what do they interact with, what do they share, right? What kind of things are working? So what we want to do first and foremost is we want to take this little checklist and ask ourselves who, what, where, when, why. I think there's supposed to be a how in there, but I don't know, right? You could say, how are they going to get the offer? Number one, who? Who is your target market, right? Ask yourself that. No matter what niche you're in, what keyword you use, who's your target market? If I go after, let's say, a trigger word like um, downloadable, okay? Let's say we use the word downloadable. 
Now we have these words, download, let's do, uh, turn this on here, okay? When we have the word downloadable, okay, not a whole lot of traffic, let's do download PDF. Okay, if we were to do download PDF, we would take a look at this word and we'd ask ourselves the question about these words. Number one, download PDF. Okay, they want to download PDF or PDF creator or whatever it is. And all this traffic's cheap, right? Download PDF to word converter. Let's say we have download to PDF word control, download PDF to word converter, if I could talk right. We have this word and we want to ask ourselves. So I want you to take this word in mind and we're going to open up a notepad here. Okay. We're going to open up this notepad and we're going to take this word, download PDF to word converter. Okay. That is our keyword. Now we want to go back and we want to ask ourselves about this word. Okay. Who is my target market? Okay. Who is my target market? Okay, let me, let me ask you guys that. Let's say you're on Google or MSN and you're bidding on the word download PDF converter. So you are gonna show up, once you search it, we'll do MSN while we wait as well. Oh, we gotta get the keyword. Okay, so down, why is this, there we go, nah, okay, download. PDF to Word Converter, PDF to Word Converter. For some reason my copy doesn't want to work. Okay, so download PDF to Word Converter. We have this here. We are going to show up up here. Okay, see, so add, 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 add. Okay, so you're gonna show up up here and you're gonna pay for the traffic that you get. So my question to you is when you look at these words on Google and Yahoo, oh, let's see. Okay, what is this? So we're going to go back here to where they are. They're going to be on Google. They're going to be on Yahoo. They're searching for download PDF to Word Converter. Great. Who's my target market? All right, answer that. Someone type your answer in the box and we'll go over that. I want you to really think about this because when you start to think about this, we're going to train your brain to start to think like mine does, which, you know, in, in internet marketing part, you don't want to think like me and other stuff. You'll go crazy. Okay, some people say no idea, contractor. Okay, what people who write a lot, blogger, again, you're overcomplicating it, okay? Kathy got it on the head. Someone who needs to download PDF to Word. Very close, okay? They need a converter. They got this PDF and they want to turn it into a Word, okay? So my target market is download PDF Word to Converter. So I would write my target market is People on Google, MSN, and Yahoo who are searching for download PDF to Word Converter. You could take it a step further and you could say, well, you know, what would they want after that? What is it? You know, they want to download this thing. They need a converter, whatever. Number two, what do they ultimately want? What does this guy ultimately want? Right? Ultimately, he wants to convert his PDF to Word. Okay, he's got a PDF. He's like, I want it to be in Word, so I could edit it, print it, download it, whatever. Okay, is everyone with me so far? Who's my target market? People on MSN and Google who are searching for download PDF to Word Converter. What do they ultimately want? They want to download a PDF to Word Converter. That's what they want. Number three, where are they coming from? They're coming from Google, MSN, Yahoo, searching for the word download PDF to Word Converter. Okay, now you could take it a step further and say, well, what does my ad say? Okay, does my ad say, well, download PDF to Word Converter? Great. Okay, that gives you another step. Next, when will they get access to it? Okay, when are they going to get access? Is this something that we're going to email them in 30 days? Are we going to give them a uh, seven-day report or seven-day email series? Or can we get them this instant result? Right? If you can get them an instant result, you're going to make fast money. If not, you'll probably make long-term lots of money. Either way works fine. One, who's your target market? Two, what do they ultimately want? Three, where are they coming from? Four, when will they get access to whatever it is they want? Five, why should they stay on my site? 
There's a question not a lot of people ask. They say, well, Marcus, how do I turn my site into a squeeze page? Hey, Marcus, how do I put this banner on uh, WordPress? Hey, Marcus, how do I put AdSense on my site? None of that matters unless you answer the question of should they stay on my site? Okay, and we're going to go through this. We're going to show you a live example of how I do this. Okay, so there we have it. Who, what, when, where, when, why? Okay, who, what, where, when, why? How could also be, if you want to add another one, we'll add one called how do I get paid? Okay, and the answer to that would be PDF toolbar. Okay, and you can go to Offer Vault here. And we can find a PDF uh, toolbar type thing. Let's wait for this to load. Okay, we'll do PDF here. And now we have, it should be in like the three, four dollar range. PDF combined, three dollars a lead. So now I get paid three dollars when someone downloads this PDF program that turns PDFs into uh, Word doc. Okay, pretty cool. Now, what we have to ask ourselves is, how do we get from point A, someone searching, to point B, I get three bucks. Okay, point A is people are searching on Google, Yahoo, MSN. Part B is me getting three bucks. Okay, everyone with me? Type three bucks if you're with me. And if you want to get from point A to point B, type that in the box too. Okay? So, here's what we do. We, we ask ourselves these questions. Okay? Then, when we're done with these questions, which I'll repeat them again. Okay? Who's your target market? What do they ultimately want? Where are they coming from? When will they get access to whatever it is I'm promising them? Why should they stay on my site? And how do I get paid? Okay? Now, let's map out point A to point B. So, here's a guy, and he wants download PDF to Word Converter. First of all, we got to get him to our site, right? First of all, we got to get him to our site. So, we need to write an ad or make a banner or whatever, okay? So, let's, let's practice by writing a little MSN ad, okay? So, we'll go to MSN. We have something like PDF to Word Converter, accurately, whatever, okay? So we could take something like this so that we could see the spacing. Okay, so I'm going to take this, copy it, and I'm going to put this in here so we can kind of model uh, the spacing here. There we go. All right, so we want to do our add. Okay, quickly convert PDF to Word. So we'll do this here. Okay. I'm going to take out quickly and I'm just going to put convert your PDFs to Word free download. Cool. Okay. Download fast and easy document converter. Okay. We're going to do this and we'll put make our little ad here and we'll put uh, download this free converter and chain and convert any PDF to Word instantly. Okay, got that? How many of you guys can write an ad like that? It's not really that hard to do. You just kind of tell people what's on your site and why they need to go there based on the word they want. Okay, if I would do something like lose 10 pounds in a week, I'd be typing lose 10 pounds in seven days or less. Click here for the free report on how to lose 10 pounds in seven days or less. All right, does everyone get that? Okay, to make sure you get it, let's do this. Okay, I want to make sure you get it. I want everyone to write an ad for the word. Um, let's say lose 10 pounds in 30 days. Okay, I want everyone to write an ad for that. Okay, your keyword is lose 10 pounds in 30 days. Um, they're on Google, MSN, Yahoo, write an ad, type it in the box. Okay. And as they come in the box, I'm going to go ahead and put them here 
so you guys can see where we're at. Now, this ad writing part is crucial to your success online, okay? So here's some of the examples we have. Okay, here's the first one, lose up to 10 pounds in 30 days. Okay, good, we got another one, lose 10 pounds in 30 days. Yep, oh, let's see. We got spend 30 days losing up to 10 pounds. We got easy way to lose 10 pounds in 30 days without exercise. Okay, great. So here's some examples of your advertisements. Now, what I want you to realize is that your advertisement, what you write here, what shows up here, changes your conversion rate on your page. Okay? Changes the conversion rate. Why? Because it changes where they are coming to, from. Okay, they're still coming from Google, but they clicked a different thing. Okay, and if they click that thing, it's because they saw it, liked it, and wanted more information. Okay, so what you're doing is you're basically going out there to all the people on Google, Yahoo, MSN, who type in download PDF to Word Converter, and you're getting them to raise their hand saying they want more information based on what you write here. So if I write here, um, let's say, uh, converter toolbar, click here to get a converter toolbar, also converts PDFs. Okay, if they click, I'm getting the people who want a converter toolbar. Okay, that weeds out a lot of people. Does that make sense to everyone? Okay, so your headline or your ad is your first chance to weed people out that you don't want. Very simple. So if you say uh, PDF converter, $27, the people looking for a free one are probably not going to click. The people who do click are going to be expecting a PDF converter that costs $27. So if it costs $28, they're going to say, well, that's not what the ad said. I'm going to get out of here. Okay. Even though that's stupid and silly and doesn't make sense to us, it makes sense to the visitor. And that's what drives your conversion. Okay. So first and foremost, we look at our ad. We ask ourselves, uh, where does this stuff come from? How does it, how are they coming here? Right. And if they click this, convert your PDFs to word free download. Now it's time to build our site. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show, show you a cheat sheet because how many of you guys, when you go to build a site, a landing page, a squeeze page, a blog, whatever, you get hung up on blogging or HTML or tech stuff. Right? How many of you guys are in tech overwhelm right now? You're like, I know kind of what I want it to look like, but I can't make it happen. Okay, very important because I always have a vision of what I want my site to be, do, and look like before I set this up. So what I'm going to tell everyone to do is don't design your site on Word. Don't design your site in an HTML editor. Don't design your site online, right? Easiest way to design your site is with a pencil and a piece of paper or Microsoft Word. Okay, Microsoft Word and the, and the Snagit program. Okay, so what I want to do is one, pick a direction I want my visitors to go. So we know variable one, who are they? People on Google and Yahoo looking up download PDF to Word Converter. Good. What do they ultimately want? A PDF converter. Good. Where are they coming from? This ad. Okay. They clicked on PDF to Word converter, quickly convert or whatever, or maybe they clicked on uh, this one, convert your PDFs to Word free download. Okay. What, uh, when will they get access? Well, they could download the toolbar instantly. And why should they stay on my site? Number one, pick a direction we want them to go. Where do we want these visitors to go? Right. Ultimately, what do we want these visitors to do? Okay, I'll give you a hint. It starts with three bucks. Okay, we want them to download the toolbar, right? Does everyone get that? We want our visitors to download the toolbar. Great. If we were going for an opt-in, we can do that as well. So first step before building your, your page, pick a direction you want your visitors to go. Where do I want them to go? Okay, I want them to do the toolbar, but I want them to get the toolbar and I want it to convert really good. Step two map out the flow I want them to take. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up Microsoft Word. 
Okay, you could do this in front page, you could do it in Word, you could do it on a piece of paper, whatever you want. Okay, and I'm going to take this piece of paper, and this is my website. Pretty cool. Okay, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to make my headline. Okay, my headline will be, nine times out of ten, I want my headline to match or expand upon what they clicked on in the first place. Okay, so they clicked on convert your PDFs to Word, free download. Great, so let's make this big, bold, okay? All right, convert your PDFs to Word free download. So first and foremost, we write our headline. Our headline is the first thing they're going to see. So they just clicked our ad. They just came to our page. We want them to see what's in it for them to stay there. We're going to answer the question by saying and reiterating, convert your PDFs to Word free download. Good. Next, what we want to do is we want to think about this market and say what would be the easiest, best way to get people to do this? What would be the easiest, best way to get people to download this PDF to Word converter? Well, we can make like a little ad. Okay, we could say, um, let's say something like, choose your browser type, then upload your files in the PDF toolbar on the next page to convert your PDF to a Word document instantly. Okay, very simple. So we could do choose your browser type. Then I can go through and I could say, well, maybe I'll go in and I will get like a little Internet Explorer thing or something like that. Let's go here and we'll do uh, IE icon. Okay, and we could take something like this. I'm just going to use Snagit to copy it. Okay. Copy like that. Go back to Word. I could put that in there. Okay, again, they're going to look kind of crude, but they'll work. All right, we could do the top browsers. We could have one for Firefox next to it. We could have one for... Um, Internet Explorer, one for Chrome, etc. Or we can say choose your file, choose your doc file below, then upload your files, then upload your file in the PDF toolbar on the next page to convert your PDF to a Word instantly. Okay, cool. So we could do this kind of thing. We could say, well, you know, what would that look like? Because we want to take a look at these things and say, well, what's this going to look like to the end user? What's it going to look like to the person that's actually downloading it, right? If I was to take this piece of paper and give this piece of paper to actually um, these people that are searching, we want it to say, hey, this is what you need to do. All right, we could do something like, let's say we went and said, upload a file. Okay, we could do Google Images and see what these look like. And let's see. Okay, you could use something like this. Okay, drop file here or upload. Um, we can do something like this, upload a file here. Okay, uh, we could do something like this. Okay, and does everyone get why this would convert well? Does everyone get that? Okay, so we could do something like, let's say we do this here, right? And we say, well, choose your file, and I want this on my page. Okay, now the, the box doesn't really even have to work, because all we're doing is telling them to get into, um, into the toolbar. Okay, so we could do something like this, all right, and put this on our page like that, and instead of upload files or something, we can actually match the button that is used on the PDF tool, okay? So we want to take a look at this landing page and say to ourselves, what do we want to do? So e click to install is like the big thing here, right? So we could actually take a button like this. So since we're matching the button, okay, we can copy it 
And then we could go and shrink it down to do like 20% maybe. Ah, uh, no, that's way too small. Oh, I'm pixels. What am I doing? 50%. 20%. There we go. Okay, let's do a little bit bigger. Cool. Okay, so we can actually take this, all right, and we can take this and put it on this page here. All right, click to install, all right, like that. And now what they're going to do is naturally they're going to click on this image, okay? So we could do something like um, find your file upload here or something like that. Okay, does that make sense? Okay, or you can do a different route, which is the step route. Okay, you could do how to convert a PDF to Word instantly. Step one, download the PDF converter toolbar free here. Okay, next we can go in and we could put like an image of the screen. Uh, let's say we wanted to do something like, uh, let's go back to it, where'd we go? Okay. All right, so we could do something like this. Okay, here's what it looks like. Okay, we could either get uh, the toolbar like this. Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of the search box to make it smaller. Okay, now the tool that I use to make this in is Snagit. Uh, which you could get, just snag it, editor, awesome tool. You're going to use it all the time. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shrink this down, and all I'm doing is dragging this like this. Okay, so there, now we have like a little image of the toolbar. So we could go through and we can make our page, and again, do it in Word. You can always take it in Word because the hardest part is making it convert. The tech stuff is easy, okay? You could, you could pay someone to do the tech stuff. The hard part is getting people to actually do this. So what I want you to do is I want you to map it out and then figure it out, okay? We're going to show you how to do it, but map it out, then figure it out, okay? When I build a site, I say, well, the best thing that would convert would be these little icons that look like this, but I don't know how to build these icons. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw it out, and then I'm going to figure it out, okay? Write that down. Draw it out, figure it out. So we're going to say, convert your PDFs to Word, free download, how to convert your PDF to Word instantly. Step one, download the PDF toolbar creator here. Great. There's a little screenshot. Now we could do click here to download the PDF converter free. 100% spyware free. Okay, or advert, whatever. You could put that or you could not put it. It's up to you. Okay, now, what am I gonna do with this here? All right, I'm gonna make this bold. I'm gonna make it blue, like a clickable blue. And I'm gonna underline it, okay? Let's make it a better blue, okay? And the difference between this blue and the better blue is gonna be the difference between like success and failure, okay? I want you guys to realize that because that is the true name of the game okay now does everyone see how that works convert your pdfs to word free download how to convert your pdf to a word instantly let's put him over this way okay step two and we can make these big and bold so we'll do step one step two Right, like this. Upload your file with the toolbar. Okay, so first and foremost, what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to go and get this toolbar. Okay, so we're going to go get this toolbar and see what it looks like. 
Easy PDF combine. Okay. And we could do like easy PDF combine like this. And see what images come up. A lot of times you'll actually see images of the toolbar and how it works. Okay, so we could go through and say, uh, let's see where it's at. Click to install. Okay, we could take a look at upload file. Okay. Okay, there you go. That's a theme. We don't want that one though. PDF Merge Files Manager. Cool. So you could do something like this. Then you go into the PDF Merge Files Manager. Um, you get the tool, whatever. Okay, so you map it out. You follow the instructions. You show them how the toolbar is going to work. So I can go here and I could do like a PDF like this. I can go into Google Chrome. I can actually get it. Oh, I'm in Windows Edge again. Let's see here. We'll go into Chrome. Why is it doing this here? Okay, well, we'll do this on another one. Um, but basically the idea is that they are going to, um, oh, there we go, that's why. Okay, the idea here is that we want them to download this installer so we could go into this. Now, here's something cool that not a lot of people do, right? What you do is you actually go through the offer as your visitor. As you go through it, you put little things like this, right? You screenshot this. Great. You go in, you screenshot this. And you can even make a video of yourself installing it and showing them how to use it. Very simple. Okay, so we do that. We hit add extension. Almost done. There we go. Now we have the toolbar. Pretty cool, right? So what we can do is we can say, well, um, click convert files. Okay, and we'll click convert files right like this. PDF converter right like this. We can copy this little screenshot, hit copy, okay? So we go step one, click here to download. Step two, upload your file with the toolbar. Click convert files on your toolbar and upload your file to the converter. Put a little screenshot of what it looks like. Next, we can go in. Okay, you can even put like, you know, when it asks you to install, uh, do this or whatever. So what we're doing is we're preconditioning them to actually get this stuff. Okay, how many of you guys are following along? How many of you guys, this makes sense to you? Okay, you can do something like click allow access to install toolbar. Okay, very simple. We can do this like this, center it, bam. Convert your PDFs to Word free download. Uh, how to convert your PDF. One, get the toolbar, good. How many of the people who come to my site do you think are gonna click on the PDF toolbar? Probably quite a few, right? They wanna do that, all right? If I get um, one out of every seven people, I'm making some decent per click money. Okay, so we precondition them, click to allow access. Two, convert your files on the toolbar. Three, step three, download in a zip file your new PDF with this PDF tool, you can convert your PDFs to docs whenever you want, okay? So now, now I have this mapped out. I say, great, this looks pretty darn good. I got this thing rolling, um, it's looking good. Okay, so now what we want to do is say, how do we put this on our, on our blog and what are we going to put in the sidebar? Okay, or are we going to have a sidebar? Are we going to have a header? These are the different types of things that make sense, okay? Now, same thing if you are going to do a page for like opting in. Okay, when we do opting in pages, again, 
we're asking ourselves the same question about our market. Okay, we want to ask ourselves the same questions about our market. And those questions are, one, pick a direction we want them to go. On this site, all I want people to do is download that toolbar, right? That's the only way I get money. So I need to push that thing pretty hard. Okay, if I say, oh, well, you know, here's five ways to do the PDF without the toolbar, but the toolbar is cool, right? You just, you just undid everything you did to get them there in the first place, right? So now that they're here, we need to say, boom, bam, here's what you need to do. Step two, map out the flow you want them to take. The flow we want them to take is bam, get that toolbar right now because that's how you're gonna convert it. So our solution is get the toolbar. Step three, we design on paper or in Word what we want our landing page to look like. Step four, all we gotta do now is go into our blog and make this stuff look real, right? How many of you guys, if I made this a web page, you think this would probably convert pretty well? Right, I'd probably get like one out of 10 people to download the, the thing, right? It's probably pretty likely 100 people come, probably get 30 to click, uh, 10 of them download, which means if I'm paying uh, less than 30 cents a click, I'm making money, right? Pretty cool. Now, if you wanna know how to do this, how many of you guys would like to know how to make this a web page? Okay, obviously if you're gonna make it a web page, you would just go in and hit control K and then you'd put your affiliate link here Okay, make it open a new, new window, right like this. Okay, same thing. Okay, how many of you guys would like that? How many of you guys think it'd be valuable to be able to turn this into content that you can either put on your blog or you can make a web page out of? All right, pretty cool. Watch, here's how you do it. You go in Microsoft Word. Is there anyone here that does not have Word or the free equivalent of Word? Okay, everyone should have it. If not, you can use the open source one. It, it's free. Most people have it. You go file, save as. When you go to save as, you choose HTML web page right here. Okay. All right, like that. Make a new folder because it's going to save our images. And we'll call it PDF man. Okay. Next, I'm going to call this file index. Bam. I just created a web page just that simple. Right there it is right there. If I was to go where I saved it, which was my documents, and then I went to PDF man right here, you see the web page here, saved our images in here. I can click it, open it up in Word, or I'm sorry, in uh, Chrome or whatever you want. You can open it anywhere, right? If I open it in Firefox, I could see where it is. Now all I got to do is put this thing on the web and we're good to go, right? Very simple. Or if I want it in um, WordPress, I just copy everything and paste it right into that box. Okay, now the same thing happens when you're doing like a opt-in page. Right, one of the opt-in pages that we are doing right now is the opt test. Okay, this simple page. This page is converting, uh, depending on the traffic, anywhere from 30 to 60% of the people who come to this page actually put their name and email in the box, which means if I pay a dollar each, I'm getting six leads for 10 bucks, which is dirt cheap. Right, how many of you guys are like, dude, that's pretty cool. If I pay 50 cents, I get six leads for three bucks. Okay, so the name of the game is making the stuff work, okay? If you can get a page that actually converts, just like we did this, okay, you can do editing and everything later. Um, if you wanna make it fancy, very simple to do. We have templates and things like that. You can also use WordPress. But the name of the game is being able to ask yourself the main questions. Who's my target market? What do they ultimately want? Where are they coming from? What will they get act or when will they get access to whatever it is? Um, why should they stay on my site? Step one, pick a direction you want your visitors to go. Bam, we want them to go to the toolbar. Step two, map out the flow you want them to take. Step three, design on paper or word what you want your landing page to look like. Step four, make your blog look as close to your map as possible. Okay, it's not gonna be perfect. Like in this example, um, it looks a little funny because of the fact that it's off to the side, right? It's off to the side here, which I don't like. Now I can go in and I can change that at the drop of a hat, but 
right now it's kind of funny, so I got to do a little bit of work. Literally, it'll take you 30 seconds, but that's the idea. Okay, so you want to make it as close as possible to what you want them to do. Step five, now you test it. So I would take that page that I just made in a couple seconds, I'd spice it up with my affiliate links, maybe put an exit pop-up on it to say, hey, wait, don't go before you download this thing. Um, and then I put my disclaimers on the bottom, bam. I test it with maybe 100 clicks. Out of the 100 clicks, I see if I can turn a profit, break even, or if I lose money, I revamp, okay? Very simple, it'll cost you about 30 bucks to test or less. Step six. I look at my results, I test, and I make it better again. How many of you guys are feeling a little bit better about this internet marketing thing now that you see that you can actually just map it out on paper, right? If you can make it in Microsoft Word, uh, say you were gonna have a sidebar or something, you'd do the same kind of thing, right? If you could do that, it would work. Now the bottom line, the bottom line here is that you need to know what works and what to test. Because up until now, a lot of you wouldn't have thought about having a little upload file to convert kind of thing, right? A lot of you probably wouldn't have thought of, okay, what version of PDF is your software in? Put a drop down box, right? We, we want to do the things that are natural, but the bottom line is you got to know what works and what to test, okay? There's a lot of things out there that I know work very well, but you might not know to test. And those things could be exactly what is holding you back? Very, very important. Okay? So, the bottom line, you need to know it. You need to know what to test and what works. And I am going to show you everything. All right? I know we breeze through the technical part. That's the part I want to teach you. I know we breeze through the psychology part of the landing page. That's what I want to teach you. You need to know what works. Uh, you need to know what to test and what works. And that's why... We are going to help you make your visitors convert with the landing page dude. Now, before you sign off saying this is the sales part of the message, hear me out because this is going to change the way you do marketing online. Okay, this is going to change the way you do marketing online. And I guarantee everyone on this call can afford what I'm about to offer because what I'm doing is I'm making it so low priced. I'm probably not even going to make anything on this. But what we're going to do is we're going to make it so low priced that you can get in, get results, and then buy my other stuff. How fair does that sound? Number one, you need to learn the number one skill responsible for making me over 5.6 million in affiliate commissions. If I didn't know this skill, I wouldn't have made that money. Okay, this is a skill that I started learning 15, almost 16 years ago, and it works. This works with affiliate commissions, AdSense, and direct product sales, and has made me millions of dollars and makes me money each and every day because of what I learned. Number one, you're going to find out what makes a landing page convert and why, right? Only 50% of the people were right about which page converted at the beginning of this webinar. Those of you who didn't get it, you need this course. Those of you who did get it, you probably got a lucky guess, which means you need this course. So we're going to show you how to find out what makes a landing page convert and why. We're going to easily show you how to set up landing pages in 45 minutes or less. You're going to get the tools and skills to set up landing pages on WordPress and basic HTML. You're going to learn how it all works. Next, you're going to discover 17 ways to get your visitor to do what you want fast. And you're going to learn how to test your landing pages for pennies on the dollar. Now, here's the deal. People who signed off, missing out, okay? Every time I get to the sales pitch, a lot of people leave because they go, well, I don't want to pay for anything. I just want to watch this and never take action and then blame Marcus that his stuff doesn't work when I really didn't take action anyway. Okay, so if you want to sign off and do that, that's fine. However, if you want to sign off because you saw 388, 197, 37, 127, and those numbers scared you, stick around because here's what we're going to do. As a bonus, we're going to, or let me go through the lineup first. You're going to learn how to test your landing pages for pennies on the dollar. Number one. You're going to get four killer landing page webinars, 388 value. Okay, this real world value, that's what I charge for my private webinars. Um, and those are the cheaper ones. Number two, you're going to get special landing page plugins. These are the ones I use on my sites. You can use them and make money. Number three, you're going to get landing page graphics pack, $37 value. Plus, you're going to get a free landing page critique, which means when you make your first landing page, I'm going to take a look at it before you run it and tell you if I think it'll work or not. 
Total value of all that combined is $749. You might be saying, Marcus, I don't have $749. I don't have $649. I don't even have $249. I don't even have $49, which is good because this is for you. And as a bonus, we're going to give you my special class, Landing Page Psychology 101, the psychology of why people do the things that make you money. If you don't get this, you're going to forever struggle. If you get it, you're not going to struggle. Now, before you order, a lot of you guys have gone to the page. Some of you might have ordered already. Don't order yet. You're going to go to landingpagedude.com slash yes. Okay? Landingpagedude.com slash yes. You are going to see this is your page. Okay, now you're going to scroll down. You're going to say, dude, this is awesome. You're really giving me 749 bucks worth of real world value for 37 bucks. And for only $37, I'm going to learn how to make landing pages the same way that you made them that made you over $5.6 million? Gee, Marcus, that sounds like an awesome deal. Well, it's going to get even better because right now it's $37. Bucks. But on this webinar, while we're on this, I want to make sure that everyone who is still listening signs up. Okay, everyone that's still on this webinar, you need this class hands down. Okay, so I want everyone to go to that link now. Let me get you guys a direct copy of the link in your chat box, okay? Click the link in your chat box, but do not sign up yet, okay? Unless you want to pay more. What we're going to do is we're going to drop the price for the next 15 minutes, okay? 37 bucks is a no-brainer, right? You could go out there, you could sell your first landing page to a company for probably 500 bucks, okay? So you're, you're making out like a bandit here, but what we're going to do is we're going to make it even easier for you to get started. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop the price, okay? And drop the price for you so that you can get in right now, okay? And once I log in, we'll have that. Bear with me one second. Is everyone on the page? Type page if you're on that page. And you guys know I don't do cheap classes, but this is something I know you need to learn. So I want to make sure that you get in, right? Now let me ask you, what price would make you get in right now? And be honest with it. Say 37 bucks, 500 bucks, whatever. Right? What would, what would it take to get you in this right now? Right? How many of you guys would sign up if I made it 27 bucks? Right? I'm sure a lot of people are going to do it for uh, 20 or 37 anyway. Okay. Let's do this. I'm going to take 30% off, and I'm going to make it just 27 bucks. That means I'm literally... Okay, someone says seven bucks. You guys want it for seven bucks? Would everyone right now sign up if I did it for seven dollars? Okay, there you go. I'm going to do that. Why am I going to do that? Because we are going to give you such good value that you're going to want other stuff, right? And there's upsells after it, of course. But what I'm going to do right now for everyone to join is I am going to make this just seven bucks. If you want to take the other stuff, because I could easily charge 500 bucks for this, easily. If I would have said 500, people would have signed up right now. But what we're going to do is we're going to make it seven bucks. I'm going to blow your socks off. I'm going to show you how to make this work. And you're going to say, holy crap, Marcus, that's what's been stopping me. And then you're just going to throw money at me because you're going to be able to make money. Right? And if that sounds fair enough to you, what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to go to the page and we're going to make this seven dollars. Okay? It's a one-time payment, seven bucks. You pay one time, you get all that stuff. Literally, if you calculate it out, there's eight hours of webinars I'm giving you plus the bonus, which means you're paying me like 70 cents an hour. Okay? 70 cents. You're like, oh, dude, that's crazy. Go do it. I want everyone to sign up, though. No one straggling, no nothing. It's a one-time thing. There's an upsell for simple sites, which you guys should have anyway. If you can't afford it, I understand. Pay your seven bucks. Go make money. Right? There's also an upsell for a uh, profit blog, which is easy as well. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to go to this page right here. And on this page, I'm going to refresh. Right now it says 37 bucks. We're going to refresh it right like this. And now it's seven bucks. You probably spent more on lunch today. You probably spent more on lattes this week. But now it's your chance to spend this on something that's actually going to work. You say, Marcus, I'm going to do it. I'm going to make it work. So everyone sign up right now. No excuses. Right? If there's someone on here who truly does not have $7, email me, get a hold of me. If you truly don't have 7 bucks, and you could say, Marcus, this is my situation. I don't have $7, but I need to make money. I'll show you how to do it. Okay? But chances are everyone does. Right? Is there anyone in that situation? All right. 
Okay, anyone who truly doesn't have it, because the only guy I see that doesn't have it is the guy who told me to go seven bucks anyway. So I know you have it because you asked me to put it at seven bucks. All right, so you can't fib, right? We've made it so cheap, it's easy to go. So I want to see everyone get on this right now. What you're going to do, the link is landingpagedude.com slash yes. Landingpagedude.com slash yes. All right, you're going to go there and you are going to sign up. All right, so any questions on this, please let me know. Um, if you take me up on the upsells, which we appreciate because I'm not making anything on this right now, we're actually paying more in affiliate commissions than you are actually paying for the course, right? So I'm actually literally paying for you to join this course, but we need everyone to sign up, all right? Let me see how close we are to getting everyone, okay? All right, we're getting there, okay? So everyone sign up and we're gonna start this class tomorrow. Okay, you're going to start tomorrow. You'll be able to actually start doing this stuff for a profit. But you got to get in there right now because in the end at 2.30, we're going to put the price back at 37 bucks, which is still an absolute ridiculous steal. Okay, now after you order, if you want to take me up on the upsell for uh, Simple Sites Big Profits, do it. It's an awesome value. Uh, if you want to take me up on the site, do it. It's an awesome value. And if you take me up on the upsells, I will build you your first landing page, okay? Whichever upsell you do, whether it's a cheap one or the big one, I will build you your first landing page, okay? You can see how we do it. You'll be done, easy to go. All right, so everyone should be getting signed up right now. We got like a couple of minutes left. Guys, seven bucks is absolutely nothing. Everyone has that. You would be absolutely insane not to do this. And you ask yourself, Marcus, if your page, that page you built live on this call, right, if that page... The one you build in Word would actually convert. All I would need to do is get three people to download this toolbar. And I, I already made $2 profit, right? So this is a test to see how many of you guys are actually serious about making this work, right? How many of you guys are actually serious about making this work? You say, Marcus, I'm serious. You're going to fill out the form, right? Seven bucks is nothing, right? It's nothing. And I never offer things for seven bucks. The only reason I'm doing it is because... We want to get you in there. All right. Any questions about this? Uh, Rob, why do we need your mailing address? Because it matches your credit card. It does a um, secure check where it says, hey, does this guy really own it? So it's a fraud thing. It's for your protection, actually. Okay. Uh, Simple Sites Big Profits is my main course. If you take that upsell, you get the entire course, which is like a 700, I think it's 797 um, for that course on its own, but you get a discount once you sign up through this, All right? So everyone should be joining. Seven bucks is absolutely retarded. I don't want any excuses. If you make excuses, you're not going to make money. You can make one of two things. You want to make excuses or you want to make money. Choose what it's going to be, okay? So everyone should be getting in there. Um, again, the upsells actually help me make money here. Um, we are actually paying on this. I'm paying out $25 affiliate commission for you to join this if you came from an affiliate. So, right, that's how serious I am about you making it work. Um, no, a niche blog is completely different from this. This is training, okay? This is all training. So what you're getting is webinars. We're gonna give you some tools, some plugins and things like that. Um, again, it's totally retarded. So like, if you don't join this, I, I don't know how I can help you, like really, okay? Uh, I don't know what restricted keywords are. Can you explain? Steve, what, where'd you hear that term? Uh, the Blog Profit Networks are a great add-on to this. This is just landing pages. What I want to do in this course is show you how to build landing pages. Okay, that's all it's about. So at the end, you're going to be like, oh, I know how to build landing pages. Okay? So... I want everyone on this call to sign up. We are, I think we're at about halfway right now. So if you're sitting there and you haven't signed up, go do it, right? Seven bucks. I mean, no brainer. It's non-refundable because this is absolutely silly. Um, so either you're serious about making this work or you're not. And what I want to do is I want to make it to where every, every single person gets the information. So at the end, for your seven bucks, you can go and build a custom landing page. 
Okay, you could do it in WordPress, you could do it in everything. We're gonna show you how to do it. Now, everyone stick around. I'm gonna send a special email to everyone once you order, and we're gonna give you a getting started email so you can get in there, um, so you don't miss the webinars. All the webinars will be recorded. Again, you're paying less than $1 an hour for the webinar. How many of you guys think that this webinar was worth more than seven bucks? How many of you guys got more than seven bucks value out of this? All right, did everyone? Okay, so you should be signing up, right? Because you're like, okay, if he gives that free, I wonder what he actually gives on the paid webinars. All right, cool. So um, good stuff. We're also going to give you a plugin that uh, on my site, it's a $37 plugin. I want you guys to have it uh, so that you guys can follow along as well. So cool stuff. Um, any other questions? We are, let's see how close we are to being filled up. This doesn't give me a tally, but we have a lot of people joining. So I want everyone to get in there. Um, again, you can make excuses or you can make money. I guarantee you, you're going to learn enough to make at least seven bucks. Um, this stuff's made me $5.6 million. So, you know, it's up to you. Um, but again, I can't twist your arm to do anything. I can't twist your arm to work. I can't tell you to do this stuff. You have to ask yourself, do I want to do something that's actually going to help me change? And is this the break I've been looking for? You say, Marcus, I've been looking at your stuff and, you know, I, I kind of need a break. Uh, I want to make it work. You know, what's the deal? Okay. You get in there and you make it work. You say, you know what? I I'm going to do this. All right. I might not have 500 bucks or a thousand bucks to buy a blog. I might be straggering. I might like Marcus's YouTube videos and I just kind of want to get started. This is for you, right? I want you to ask yourself, am I going to pass up this opportunity for this tiny amount, right? Am I really going to do that? Okay, am, am I really going to pass this up? Okay, and then you're going to say to yourself, in six minutes when I change the price back up, you're going to say, damn, I lost 30 bucks and, uh, you know, instantly. And then you're going to say to yourself, well, am I going to pass this up? Learning a skill because I'm not going to get some course that's confusing. I'm going to learn a skill that I could go to the CPA networks. So I can get an offer. I can build a page and I can get traffic and make money. That's, that's basically it, right? So it's time right now for you to go over there and get in. And I think, uh, let's see how close we are to capacity of the $7 one. And then I'll change it back again. You have minutes left. Um, I will put a timer on as soon as I find my Excel here. Yeah, where'd we go? And our credit card form is completely secure. We go through a uh, third party um, authorized.net, which is like the biggest of all the ones online. Okay, so we are right around half capacity. So there's a lot of people just messing around, not getting in. Um, yes, everyone should buy this. If you own my other stuff, you should, you should get this at seven bucks, right? Get it. Um, obviously, you know, if you have my other stuff, this is worth it. That'll allow you to attend them, attend them live. Uh, by the way, I went to a movie for my birthday, which was last week, uh, and it was 1050 for a movie ticket, right? So I want to ask, you know, you can get $10 and 50 cents worth of entertainment and get fat from popcorn or you could learn how to make a difference in your life it's up to you right and i know popcorn is like totally uh, addicting right uh, but what i want you to do is get in there everyone needs it if you have my stuff already um if you're new to my stuff you absolutely need to get it and thank you for the birthday wishes great uh, james says no one's more broke than me but i bought it uh, james i beg to differ uh, this week, I've been doing a study on politics and hunger in America, which is my next big challenge to try to help people out of. Um, so that's pretty cool. But I doubt it, right? Everyone's got seven bucks. If you're on this call, you got internet, you got seven bucks. Okay, any other questions? Again, the upsells, guys, they're worth their weight in gold as well. Um, so if you say, Marcus, I want an upsell, get the upsell, right? Really cool. Um, if you need help with stuff, we just want to get you in here, get you into the training, get you used to how it works and get you hopefully making some money, right? And we're going to show you how to do it. Uh, how many of you guys like that little tip I gave you with, uh, with Word, like making a website in Microsoft Word? Did you guys like that? Okay, if you liked it, we're going to show you how to do that and also add opt-in forms and make pages, everything. It's so easy, your head's going to spin. Okay, so 
very, very, very easy to do. All right, looks like we got a lot of stragglers there. The price is going up. You got three minutes. Um, my intention, I was going to give you guys the program for 27 bucks today, but someone was like, do it for seven. So I caved to peer pressure, but I want to make sure everyone gets in. So um, cool stuff. All right, Bianca, yeah, after you learn this, you can, you can get the upsells later if you want. Um, very easy to do. Okay. Yeah, like Steve says, geez, man, movie tickets are 10 bucks. Haven't been to a movie in seven years. Um, yeah, cool. So really easy. Uh, Steve, you can get me on live chat if you have any questions on live chat. Uh, there will be a replay of this on the replay. It's going to be 37 bucks, but it's worth its weight in gold. I might hide a link on this page that you're watching the replay on where you can find it for seven. So if you find that link, you know, maybe. But uh, for the rest of you, get in right now. Totally cool. Uh, there is replays of all the webinars that are part of this course will be replayed. Okay, so all this stuff you will get uh, as a download. Okay, so cool stuff. All right, again, um, there's still people that are sitting around here. You want to go to landingpagedude.com slash yes. Sign up right now. Um, again, you got the world to gain. And if you want to put it technically, seven bucks to lose, right? Um, so can you afford to lose seven bucks? Well, the only way you're going to lose it is if you don't show up, if you don't watch the videos, if you vanish and you just like zone out and do nothing, right? If you actually use this stuff, I cannot be held responsible for the insane, awesome results you get, right? So cool stuff. Okay, any other questions? Let me know. Um, Kent, good question. He says, I received an invoice, but I don't see a link for the course. Great, there is no link yet. Uh, this is something we just built today. Uh, we will have you guys set up on uh, landing page, dude, um, shortly. That's where you're gonna go to log in and everything like that. All right, so. There's a couple of you guys just waiting for me to raise the price. So I'm going to give you a little timer. And I think I can do this timer. Bear with me one second. And I will get our timer here. Okay, let's get our timer. And you are going to go to landingpagedude.com slash yes. And I am going to give you three minutes to sign up okay here is our timer it's starting right now if you miss out in three minutes right if you miss out in three minutes you're gonna have to pay 30 bucks so you could save about ten dollars a minute by signing up in the next three minutes okay and again everyone needs this this is the break you've been waiting for at the price you can't say no to right so this is my goal i want to see the highest rate of conversion rate i could possibly get on a webinar okay so here we go, uh, two minutes and 42 seconds left. Um, there's no monthly membership. The only thing you are charged is seven bucks for joining that. If you do an upsell, you'll be charged for the upsell, obviously. If you wanna join our monthly club, you could do that later. But right now, all you're signing up for is $7 one time. All right, that's it. One single tiny little bit. Um, after I pay the affiliates and after I, uh, after I get my credit card fees and everything, I'm making negative $19, right? I just did the math. I make negative 19 bucks. That's how serious I am about you getting in here. And I don't want anyone to mess around. I want everyone to do it. All right. Uh, Lori, Laura says, good timing on this. I really need some help with landing pages right now. Yes, that's why we're doing this. I have had a huge, huge amount of people talking to me about landing pages. That's why I'm saying, you know what? I'm going to offer this. I'm going to offer it at a price that everyone can afford and no one has excuses so that you get in there, you start using it, you start making it work. All right, so I'm going to stop talking. You got a minute, 37 seconds. As soon as I get back, I'm going to change that price back to 37 bucks. So get in there now. I'm going to go grab some more coffee and I'll be right back. Oh, and by the way, you do get the upsells instantly. So if you get simple sites, you'll get your passcodes instantly. If you get the other upsells, you'll get those instantly.
I think it's going to be funny too when uh, people watch the replay. The people who sign off before the sales pitch, they're going to love this one. So at any rate, get in there. Uh, for those listening, oh, 11 seconds. So get in now. Um, you're going to have about 15 seconds from now because I have to go change the page. But you're going to be able to get in. Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do, I am going to change it for five minutes. I'm going to change it to 20, or 17 bucks. Okay. So we're going to change it to 17 bucks. We'll give you five minutes. And we're going to show you how this thing works because you got to get in there. Okay, so we're going to change it to 17. If you're already in there, great. If you're not, it is now going to be 17 bucks. Okay, uh, let's see if I can find it. Well, while, while I'm doing this, you guys can actually sign up. Um, but uh, let's see here. Okay, yeah, we do need music in the background. Uh, Don. Yeah, we'll give you give you the time for that. Uh, so we're going to change it here to landing page dude. And you can watch me live as I change this to 17 bucks. So now you're going to have five minutes to get in there. Let's make sure that it is working. Okay, so here we go. Here's the page. It was seven bucks. Now it's going to be 17. Okay, and we're going to give you five minutes, same page. All right, let's see how serious you are. You can keep waiting, and it's going to keep going up, or you can wait. Let's give you five minutes. There we go. All right, cool. All right, any other questions, let me know. Uh, at the end of these five minutes, we're going to make it go up again. All right, so it's up to you. This is how serious I am about, hey, you know what? This is, like, what you need to be able to make this work. So if you want to mess around and you say, well, Marcus, I, I, uh, you know, I don't believe any internet marketer wants to help me. Uh, you know, I read something online about your stuff's not that great from one guy who said it on one page and that's all I listened to. Uh, or you could say, Marcus, you know what? Hey, you know what? I've heard things, actually really good things. And I've heard some other things and uh, seven bucks, you know what? Prove me wrong. So that's what we're going to do. Get in there make it happen all right so any other questions please let me know and again i want everyone who's sitting there on this webinar to sign up if you've already signed up just type already in or yes or something like that so i can welcome you and uh, for the rest of you you got four minutes now at 17 bucks okay and even at 17 bucks it's a steal Guys, this is an easy course I could charge a couple hundred bucks for, no problem. Okay? And it'd be worth its weight in gold still. So, let's see how smart you are today. Okay, cool. All right, any other questions, let me know. And we'll go from there. Any questions about the course or anything like that? Uh, no, there's no downloads. There's no codes yet. This is a brand new course. Um, so you want to get in and, and we'll be sending you the stuff shortly. Okay. Um, be sure to take your time, look at the upsells, get the ones that look good to you. Um, again, that's pretty much all I'm making on this course is if you get an upsell. So if you appreciate this stuff and you like it and you want the extra help, go for it. Okay. All right. So 17 bucks will change in just a minute. All right, so any other questions, please let me know. And the course is going to start tomorrow. And if I can get this thing to copy, I can get us a count. Okay, cool. All right, so... Last minute stragglers, get yourselves in there. Two minutes and it's going to go up again. Okay. All right, so you're going to miss out in two minutes. It's going to go up to 27.
Okay. And the upsells we will get you guys started on. Uh, you'll get this the information instantly. So you'll get the logins. If you get the simple sites upsell, you'll get the logins. Um, but again, this course is one-time fee. So seven bucks, if that's all you're getting, get it. And uh, that's all you'll uh, have for there. Okay. All right, a minute 20 left. And then we're ready to go. Okay, so um, any questions about landing pages or anything we covered in the topic before I leave? Okay, so we'll take a couple questions for uh, those of you who are straggling around. Um, again, oh, 41 seconds, let me go in there and change that real quick. 37, so you guys got a couple of seconds. Don't want to miss out on this. All right, eight seconds, 17 bucks is going away in eight seconds. One, all right, so you got a couple of seconds. Here it is at 17, I'm gonna change it right now. And it's gonna be 27. So those of you who have the page filled out, get in now, it's going up. And now it's going up. Oh, I gotta log in again. Oh, you guys are lucky. <laughs> I gotta log in again here. Okay, so 27 and save all right so 27 bucks is where it's going to remain until the course is done so those watching the replay 27 bucks is still an absolute steal um, for this course absolute no-brainer landingpagedude.com slash yes landingpagedude.com slash yes uh, if you're serious about making money guys this is only seven or 27 bucks now 17 bucks and it's worth its weight in gold it's still less than like four bucks per webinar uh, if you calculate it all out um, and you're getting the plugin, which on its own is 37 bucks. So you're getting a ton of value here. Um, and again, if you like the upsells, if you want to take me up on those, let me know. Um, this is absolute insanity for those who really, really want to do it and those who really want to make it work. Um, so get in there. All right. Any questions? Let's open our question box. Uh, Kent, what's the difference between the Upsell and blog profit network offer. Is there a benefit to getting both? Uh, Kent, go ahead and get the simple sites upsell and then get me on live chat. Okay, I got a special bonus for you. Okay. Uh, yes, all the webinar trainings for this course are going to be well worth it. They will be recorded. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, we'll have a special place where you can get in there and use those. Um, tomorrow, we're going to give you guys your logins. We might have a webinar tomorrow, depending on my... Uh, schedule. Uh, if we do have a webinar, it will be um, the 10 o'clock spot in the morning Pacific time or 1 o'clock. So 10 or 1. We'll let you know as soon as possible once we get everyone in there. Okay. So any other questions, let me know. Um, again, the upsells are really good. That's the only place you can get that stuff for that awesome price. Uh, really cool. Okay, Isaac, what you're getting today, I'll recap the offer for those of you uh, that want to get in. Again, it's at 27 bucks. It'll stay at 27 bucks. Um, I might have a hidden link somewhere on this page that's seven bucks. If you guys can find it on the replay, if not, get in at 27. It's worth its weight in gold. You are getting uh, the number one skill that's responsible for making me over $5.6 million in affiliate commissions, AdSense, and direct product sales. Again, I don't know what you're going to make, but this is the best way to learn this stuff. You need to learn the skill of putting a page up that makes people take action. If you don't learn that skill, people won't take action and you won't make money. You're going to learn, uh, you're going to find out what makes a landing page convert and why. You're going to easily learn how to set up landing pages in 45 minutes or less. You're going to get the tools and skills to set up landing pages on WordPress and basic HTML. You're going to discover 17 ways 
to get your visitor to do what you want fast. Plus, you're gonna learn how to test your landing pages for pennies on the dollar. It's a no-brainer. You get four killer landing page webinars, recorded, Q&A, live, if you wanna make it live. You get special landing page plugins and templates. I'm gonna give you my Microsoft Word templates as well as some other stuff and show you where to get an easy HTML editor for free. Landing page graphics pack, plus a landing page critique. Total value of that is $749. I'm not done yet. I'm also putting on the landing page psych 101 class. Right now, this course is only $27, bucks, which is an absolute no-brainer. Get in there, landingpagedude.com forward slash yes. The price will be going up to where it should be, right? So what you want to do is you want to get in there now. Um, little couple of uh, house cleaning things. One, our support site is being rebuilt. So our support tickets have not vanished. Don't worry. We're just rebuilding the site. It'll be back online tonight. Uh, or tomorrow morning at the latest, um, we'll get it in there. Another bit of housekeeping, you will get your emails for this. After you join, you go on a special list, you're gonna get the emails, everything like that. It's all automated, so we're gonna help you make this work. Guys, you need to join this because you need to learn this skill. This is the one skill that is stopping you from making money online. So learn this skill, and uh, you're gonna be light years ahead of where you were before. All right, guys, I'm going to keep this up. We will get the replay out. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, say, Marcus, I'm serious, and I'm ready to get started. Join, grab some of those upsells while you can, um, and we're gonna make this stuff work for you. So all you gotta do is say, Marcus, maybe, maybe, I'm ready to go, right? Show me how to do it, and we're gonna show you how to do it, and at the end of this course, you're gonna say, Marcus, I wanna buy tons of other stuff, because you showed me value. That's what this is about. That's why we're doing this so low. Otherwise, I wouldn't. This is my chance to take you and say, hey, give me a chance. Let's help you out. Let's make this work. Uh, for those of you that are joining, get in there now. And uh, if you have any questions about landing pages or anything like that, we will have them on the replay. Uh, for those of you who are getting the upsells, Simple Sites is the best upsell. Um, there's a killer price on that as an upsell and the um, done for you sites as well. Now, if you take me up on one of those upsells, okay, if you need to go back and find them again, just get me on live chat, we'll give you the links to them. If you take me up on either of the upsells, I will build your first landing page for an affiliate offer that's out there. Okay, you guys have known I've built tens of thousands of them. I've spent over 1.5 million on traffic. I know what makes people convert. And at the end of this course, you will too. So learn this or struggle forever with converting your traffic. That's all I got to say. I hope you enjoyed this. I'm gonna sell this hard because everyone's got seven bucks, or 27 bucks now. Everyone's got enough to join it, so you have no excuse. All you gotta do is say, Marcus, I'm in. I'm ready to make it work. And we're gonna show you how to make landing pages, and I hope you guys liked my graphic I made for you. All right, the landing page dude graphic. All right, really cool. I'll show you that program as well. It's, I think that program's like 40 bucks. Uh, or you could do it with Snagit, okay? So get a free trial of Snagit, use it. All right, any other questions, please let me know via live chat. Uh, for the rest of you who are gonna be joining, that's landingpagedude.com slash yes, get in there. Paul, if you already have simple sites, um, we can help you with that, uh, or you could get the site thing, or hit me up on live chat, we'll give you something uh, as well. So get in there, let's make it work. Guys, I'm gonna see you in class because you're all gonna join. Um, and we're gonna, we're gonna make it happen. So thanks a lot for joining. Uh, the Psych 101 class alone is probably a, gonna be a $97 course, um, and this is your chance to get it. So if you have any questions, let me know. Um, someone said something about a Chrome extension. Yes, we do have a Chrome extension. Um, I'll get you guys that link as well, okay? All right, awesome. So get all the upsells, get this stuff. If you only got uh, 27 bucks, get in there, make it happen. I'm gonna show you how to make this work. You're gonna make some money. Again. Um, we will have you guys uh, some notes and stuff on this as well. For now, landingpagedude.com slash yes. Go there, say yes, and say you're ready to make money. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next webinar.